might as well be video, right? I mean, well, you, it's, you, you, know, you impacted the game. Yeah, I think that more than anything. I mean, as a player, you want to feel like you made an impact, you know, on the game and, and at the highest level. And, you know, when, when you're mentioned by, by a move that was created, it was like you added, I added something to the game that wasn't there before. Absolutely. So that's, that's a nice memory to have. What are you most proud of? I think uh, just uh, really my my whole career, you know, just most proud of using my ability, whatever it was that God gave me, to honor him, to glorify him to the best I could. I wasn't blessed with size, you know. Super, I was athletic. I wasn't super athlete by any means. Uh, but I worked and developed my skill level to where I was able to compete at the highest level. Uh, really no one really expected that to happen. Mm -hmm. uh, all the you? way up, I was too small, too short, yeah. you know, wasn't fast enough, couldn't jump high enough. But, you know, God had a plan for my life. And, uh, you know, one of my favorite scripture verses, Ephesians 3.20, says to him who's able to do exceeding abundantly beyond all that we can ask or think, you know, that's the God that I serve and I believe in. And, you know, I tell people all the time, you know, my plan was to just be good enough to go to college and get my education paid for. I didn't have any kind of visions of grandeur of being an NBA player. Really? At 5'11", 155 pounds coming out of, coming out of high school. And, uh, and yet God's plan for me was to go to Georgia Tech, play in the ACC, be a four-time All-ACC player, two-time All-American, get drafted, go to Cleveland, become a four-time All-Star, win two three-point shootouts, Dream Team 2, you know, had my jersey retired. That was God's plan. That wasn't my plan. And, uh, and so, you know, just to see him give me that platform, and it was for reasons like this, where I could come and share and hear about my basketball, but get to share my story about Christ and what he, he did for me and given me his salvation, his love. You know, I put my faith and trust in him at a, at a young age, junior in high school. I was going to ask you when it was. You were a junior. And uh, that's when yeah. the whole basketball thing changed, you know, because he just threw me out there and, and said, you know what, because so many of the reasons is, you know, if I walk in 